Greetings, viewers. I have returned to answer the question, some truth. What is it that annoys you the most that goes on in the world? Well, I must say, to even prepare a lecture on answering this question raised my blood pressure level to an all-time high. My answer to what annoys me the most in this world is the ever-so-evil and heart-wrenching child abduction. Here's a disturbing fact for you. Did you know that every 40 seconds in the United States, a child becomes missing or abducted? Hmm. Did you know that 53% of non-family abductions are committed by people known to the victim? Now that's appalling. But, what's more detestable is when a child is missing, abducted, or even worse, murdered, and the immediate family appear to have no information at all, but at the end of it all, they become the prime suspects or even the culprit. I loathe this subject because I found that a person has to literally sear or remove his or her conscience to offend or harm a child. In doing so, I see that the very act makes them inhuman to almost a beast like kindred, to some alien monstrosity. I've grown quite weary of seeing articles and posters of countless children missing, little boys and little girls abused, brutally beaten and ultimately killed. I hate the time that it takes during the search for the child. I hate the way the unproductive days chip away at the possibility of even recovering the child. I abhor the blanket hide-and-seek statements of friends and families only to find the cold grave of the child in the backyard not too far from the house. I must say in all my disgust to all the pedophiles, abductors and family members who perform these terrible acts, you will pay for your evil. Either now, while you stand here on earth by our wonderful justice system. <laughs> Oh, by God, when you stand before him and he reveals all that you've done, in, even in secret, I gather you will be reprimanded bountifully, especially for the mistreatment of children. If you have some sort of problem with being around children, I suggest you seek some spiritual and psychological help. It is such a sad, sad experience for families to go through when a child becomes missing and, and taken away from their home and parents. Just think of the horrifying trauma one could feel to never know if the child is still alive. No closure. Constant imagery of what could have taken place to the helpless child. Oh, oh, that horror. Oh, predators and disregarders of adolescent life, you will pay dearly. Ah, oh, I apologize, my viewers. I did get a bit carried away. Bear with me. I, I, I hope I answered the question properly. That is just one thing that annoys me that goes on in this world. But of course, there is more, and I wouldn't mind telling you more. But I'm not totally convinced. No. I'm not convinced that my viewers can embrace some truth.